Morning. Good morning, guys. Excuse our mess. This is what we woke up to. It looks like Don thought he was in a jar. It's, Look in, at that. He's in ice. He wasn't there this morning. Cause and I got, that's Elsa. I got fully dressed. <laughs> she froze off. him. He wasn't there. <laughs> what the heck? No, I said the same thing. I love it. He must have messed with her. Oh my gosh. Is right. He's melting. Wait, how did it after he Look at that. Elsa froze him. That looks like those strawberries where I dried. What you could buy. Good morning everyone. Welcome back to our channel. It is December the 10th. It's a Tuesday and I just dropped off the kids. I'm in my car right now and I just wanted to introduce our video for today. I am hoping to bring you along with us um, and have a little bit more going on today. We always have something going on. It's just like, I just don't know if it's like worthy. I want to give you something that you can watch and not just like you know, something that there you can join us along with, I guess is what the better term to say. So this is something that was brought on as a challenge that I was challenged personally by my five-year-old. He's very into YouTube right now, he follows a few families online. I don't think he really understands the concept that I am trying to put some material on here so that we could share our journey, share our testimony with people and, you know, dealing with life after loss. Hey everyone, good evening. It is December the 10th. It is now Tuesday evening and I am just jumping on really quick. We don't really have anything to share today. It's been a pretty low-key evening, just like the other day. Uh, we got some, I got some work done and I got, I was pretty productive today. Hi guys. Hi, Dominic's feeling better, thank goodness. He's been a little bit under the weather. And he actually took a nap after school, which I normally do not permit because then I have so much trouble putting them to bed. But in this case, he needed the rest. So with that and a couple of Mexican remedies, we got some Vicks going, an alcohol bath, wrapped him up like a baby burrito, and he's feeling a lot better. But yeah, that's pretty much what's going on today. We just stayed home. We ran out to H-E-B real quick because Dominic needed some a snack for his class. We had some quick dinner. And we're just hanging out, so I'm going to show you all real quick what the advent calendar. Today is just kind of like a reward. We really didn't do an activity. It's this. Gone in this a while back. They wanted to try it out. It is an Oreo Crunch bar. It is a big size. I think it's like a 10 ounce bar, correct? Can we open it? And Daddy or Milton's favorite like chocolate bar brand, one of his very favorite brands is this Milka. They also um, have some other ones that have like berries and nuts in it and just different varieties. But yeah, it's a good brand. So we're going to try it out. This is going to be, of course, not all of it. We do not need to, like they already can't sleep, right Dom? But we are going to go ahead and let them have a little bit of a treat. And we're just going to watch some cartoons in my room and unwind and call it a day. I did, if I haven't already, the elf and how we found him this morning. It was so crazy. Do you want to tell them about the elf? Well, Elsa froze him. Yeah. Elsa froze him? Yeah, I don't know how, but... Elf moves the toys. Yeah, so we found Elfie Jingles, which is the name of our elf, this morning, encapsulated in this frozen kind of... Um, Dominic woke up and thought he was in a jar. Right, Dom? Dom thought he was in the jar. He's like, I was asleep. I got them up. Usually the routine is they get up and if it's early enough, six o'clock in the morning, they'll get up and get dressed and then come and lie down and cuddle with me for a little while. And Sabrina had woken up and she moved. Dominic ended up with me at three o'clock in the morning because that's just been his thing lately. And when he's been sick, I just cuddle with him, put some fix on him and make sure he's bundled up and he goes back to sleep. So Sabrina woke up this morning at 6 and she says she didn't see him. I went to sleep, had no contacts on, so I couldn't see. And then she came to bed and we all like lay down. And when it was time for Dom to get up and get his socks on or change out his socks, then that's when he went to the room and the elf was in a jar. That's what he What's said. My Elsa toy. With well, his Elsa toy and like his reindeer. So it looks like as we look closer, 
that it wasn't a jar, but in fact he was encased in a cube of ice. I don't know how he did that, but he was encased in a cube of ice, and it turned into a mess, which of course I had to clean up. And um, yeah, when the kids came home from school, he was just kind of laying there in between the toys. So let's see where he ends up tonight. Holding his hands together, Dominic says. So yeah, that's what's going on. So um, you have a good night, and we'll we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Hey guys. Um, so how is it? Good. On a scale of one to ten, Bina, an eight, an eight, Dominic.